like this. Now fit snugly. Now that bolt looks close, but it's not touching. But right here is you have to bring this little shaft piece down. You know, grind that down a bit, and then you have to take this part down a little bit. That is actually holds the drive, the drive gear for the pump. Get this back in there, and then so this drive gear, this tang right here, you have to take out oh, about that much. It's it's easier to tell once you got it back in the case, but um, because what happens is the shoulder bottoms out on the front of the cam. You see right here. So that is touching. Should not be touching all the way. Bad camera angle, but there you go. You can see how it's bottomed out. And with it installed, if you look at how far this sits out, when you put it back in the, sorry, when you put it back in, you bottom out the housing, and you put the gear back in, get it lined up, there's a problem. See the gear sticks out? So, what you have to do, there's how the gear should sit, nice and flush, so you don't get a lot of pressure to blow by. I like that. So we got to take the end of that tang off that I just showed you. Right there. And I've already taken some of the meat off of this case, and a little bit back off on the pin. So it'll clear these bolts, which I initially had with lock washers, and now we're going to put... No lock washer.